Hey guys, welcome to your career and money reading. This is gonna be for your um, June 2024. You can apply this to your sun, moon, rising, Venus signs. We are gonna take a look and see what is going on with you guys in your career and your finances. And then we'll take a look and see what else you guys need to know, look out for, work on, um, apply this to your own unique situations. Keep in mind that these are general messages. Take what resonates and leave the rest behind. Uh, if this message didn't resonate with you, uh, take a look at your other placements. Keep in mind that these are collective messages for the collective uh, Sagittarius people. Not tapping into one specific person's energies in particular. Uh, if you're looking for a reading that's tailored specifically to your unique situations and your energies, I suggest you to um, book a personal reading with me. The link for that is in the description box below. Like, share, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell so that you guys get notified on when my new video is posted and when I go live. Also, if you guys are interested in following me on TikTok, Instagram, my other YouTube channel that's dedicated solely to my travels, the links for those are in the description box below. Support me on there too. So, Sagittarius. Tell me about Sagittarius. Sagittarius in um, their career and their finances. What's going on with Sagittarius in their career and their finances for uh, June 2024? Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs for Sagittarius. with the ace of swords here and the knight of wands seems like you guys had some sort of major breakthrough or you guys are having some sort of major breakthrough here and you guys are just going for it something that you're really passionate about okay you know i, I just see I, I just feel like you guys kind of just kind of had this like aha moment and you're like okay you know some uh, you know light bulb went off and you guys are just going for it here something that you're really passionate about like i said you know so it could be something in the performing arts you know acting singing here with the two of pentacles here and the four of pentacles this is interesting because I feel like you guys are doing a lot at this time here or that you guys have been working like a lot of uh, jobs for a while and you know with the four of pentacles you know there could be some sort of worries surrounding your finances here okay uh page of wands here and the king uh and the emperor here Aries energy okay I mean someone here could be going to school about performing arts or something like that now, if someone here is asking, like a parent, for assistance, for some sort of assistance and so, some sort of financial help, okay, I do feel like this parent will help you out, okay? Someone here, a light bulb just went off, and I feel like someone here is realizing what their calling is and what they're meant to do here, okay? Tell me about the emperor here. Why is the emperor here? The emperor and the ace of cups, okay. Tell me about the page of wands here and the nine of pentacles. Interesting. So like I said, if you are realizing that you want to do something here that will help you further you in your career or something like that in your finances here, someone here is willing to help you. Someone here is willing to give you the money to help you. Let's say if you're going to school for like singing or acting, you know, or something that has to do with the arts, this person will help you. All right. The four of pentacles here. We have judgment, Sagittarius energy. Tell me the two of pentacles here. With the Eight of Pentacles, yeah, I just feel like you have been in this sort of like very monotonous energy here. And I feel like you guys realized that it was not for you because you were caught in some sort of routine here or that you guys felt limited or stifled by the work that you were doing. Interesting. I feel like some of you guys could have been flight attendants here. I don't know why I'm getting that. Okay. Some of you guys could have been flight attendants. And, you know, I feel like you guys just realized that, you know, doing the flight attendant work, traveling around, like, you know, a lot was really sort of like hurting your body and damaging your body and that you guys were not getting enough rest and that your world was surrounded or being controlled by this workplace that you're working in. And you feel like you guys had to get out, okay? The Knight of Wands here. The Queen of Cups, Cancer Scorpio, Pisces, with the Ace of Swords. I yeah, I don't know why. I do feel like someone here is realizing that. You know, I even getting let's say if you are a flight attendant, 
you realize that when you were getting into it, you're just going to be doing it for a short time. And you just feel like the time has ran out here, you know? And I feel like you're just ready for something new here, Sagittarius. Queen of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, and the Wheel of Fortune here. What else do we have here for? Yeah, it could be a situation that your luck is changing or that you're getting your next big break here or that you're ready for that next chapter in your life. What else do we have here for Sagittarius? What else does Sagittarius need to know, look out for, work on? For June 2024, Sun, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs for um for Sagittarius for Sagittarius six of wands and the ten of swords I, I I do you feel like you guys could be ending employment here like I said, I, I don't know why I'm getting this. Some of you guys could be flight attendants. I don't know. Yeah, some of you guys could. Yeah, I do feel like some of you guys could have been working in the travel industry for a while here. And I just feel like you guys are tired, exhausted. Your body's hurting. You're aching, you know. And I feel like you don't want to be limited by your job. You don't want to be limited by the company that you work at, okay? Uh, yeah, I just feel like... I'm, you know, even though, you know, the travel link thing could be, you know, amazing. There's a benefits to it. I do feel like, you know, when you work in that field, especially like when I, you know, someone as a flight attendant, I, I just feel like the work-life balance is a little difficult. Um, I might be wrong, uh, but, you know, maybe different companies have different policies, but, you know, I just feel like, you know, especially the flight attendants I do know, um, they don't get a whole lot of freedom. You know, everything that they do kind of like, it's surrounded by this company that they work at. So we have the Empress, Libra Taurus, we have the Chariot here. We have the uh, Justice card and the Hangman. Uh, not the Justice card, the Chariot and the Hangman with the uh, Empress here and the Sun. You know, whatever you've been doing here too, it could be also inf uh, infecting. <laughs> affecting your romantic relationship here too. So that's why there's a huge shift. There's a big change that's coming here. Okay, so I feel like uh, for the month of June, some of you guys could be going through some major transitions. Some big changes are upon you here. Uh, Queen of Swords and the Six of Cups. We have the Six of Swords and the Eight of Swords. Yeah, some of you here feel stifled, feels trapped in the work situation that they've been in here. And I feel like some of you here could, be, could have been doing it for a long time. Maybe some of you here has been doing it for the last like three to six years or something like that. Okay, um, so I feel like perhaps someone's contract is up here and I feel like some of you here is not re-signing. Okay, the Ten of Swords here and the... Uh, the uh, uh, Temperance card, Sagittarius Energy, the uh, Six of Wands here, and the Ten of Pentacles. So, whatever this light bulb went off here, wh whatever you guys are about to, sp to pursue, this new chat that you're about to pursue here, I do feel like, I wouldn't say that your finances is horrible right now, but I feel like it's going to gradually or significantly significantly improve here, okay? Uh, with Temperance here, I feel like your guys, your angels, your ancestors are kind of like pulling you out of the situation here because they see that you are hurting here, okay? Uh, because it, there is some sort of physical pain or that someone's body, their synchronized rhythm hasn't really caught up to them, you know? And I just feel like someone here is just done, all right? So Sagittarius, I hope that this was helpful. I hope that this resonated. If it did, leave a comment down in the comment section below. Like this video, share this video, subscribe, hit the notification bell. I'll speak to you guys in the next one. Thanks guys. Bye.